to log on to your test, you want to first power off your computer using this power button right here. So hold that down. And then you're going to get these options here. You're going to power off your computer. So click that. Give your computer some time to turn off. And then you're going to come back here and power your computer back on. Using the same power button that you use to turn the computer off. Once your computer powers back on, you're going to get Chrome. And then once it turns completely on, you're going to get this Lake Forest background. And now you have options here to shut down. You can click on some apps and you can add people. Do not log back in here or you're going to lose this option. And this option is what you need here to test. So you're going to go to apps and you're going to select the last one, the one that says NWEA secure testing. And then you're going to log in or click that icon once your network is connected. You're going to use the, the session name and the password that your teacher gave to you before you shut down your computer. So you're going to put in that, that information. And you're going to put in the session password. And then you're going to push this blue arrow here. Now, obviously, your teacher gave you a different session name and a different password. Use the session name and password that your teacher will give you. You're going to use this arrow here to click your name. So your classmate's name is going to be on here. Once you use that arrow, you're going to select your name. So I'm going to click the arrow and I'm going to select the name. So once you click your name, you can click this arrow here. And then once you have this information, you can use the yes. Is this correct? So if this is not your name, obviously you will select no and you will go back and select the correct name. So make sure you have the correct name. When you have your name, you can select yes. Once you get to this screen, you are ready to begin testing. Your teacher will start the test on, your, on that end. So you just have to wait here and be patient. Now, once you are inside of the test and you may have a question about something, you can use the power button. If you need to get to your teacher, you will use the power button and you will just sign out. And then you would log back in, go to Google Classroom and join your homeroom class and ask your teacher a question. That's only if you have a really important question Otherwise, sit and continue your test. Do your best. Do not rush and answer every question to the best of your ability.